Okay, so you've made your MovieZoo video, your MovieZoo movie, and now you want to broadcast it, you want to put it up on the uh, on the web. Well, uh, in this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to do that. It's really quite easy. You can do everything that you need to do from within the MovieZoo 3D application. And in this case, I'm going to show you how you upload to our website, MovieZoo.com. But first of all, an explanation of what's going to happen. What we're going to do here is we're going to have a video made in MovieZoo right here. We're then going to use MovieZoo's upload facility to send the video up to the web. Now by default MovieZoo goes all the way to YouTube. Your video is going to appear on YouTube first of all and then it's going to automatically be found by your website and put on the front page as long as you've got the latest tab selected. So a note about some times. The process of getting your video from MovieZoo to YouTube takes a little bit of time. It has to upload it and then YouTube has to process it and do whatever it's got to do, check it's not using illegal music, blah 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 blah. So it's going to take a little bit of time before your video appears on YouTube. Then YouTube spends ages before it releases that video to MovieZoo.com and also when it arrives at MovieZoo.com we've got people here who look at it make sure it's uh, of appropriate quality and content before it will appear on our gallery page. So what I'm basically saying is it's not instant. When it leaves MovieZoo it can take a bit of time to get to YouTube and it can take even longer, sometimes overnight, before it arrives on MovieZoo.com. Now you don't have to upload it to MovieZoo.com um, or indeed put it on YouTube. This pipeline here represents the easiest and most straightforward route to getting fame and your video published online. Because at the end of the day all MovieZoo does is it gives you an AVI file, a little movie file, and you can do with that whatever you like. You can keep it secret, you can use some other means of broadcast, um, or you can hawk it around the big film and TV studios if you like. Anyway, let's head over to MovieZoo and I'll show you what we've got going on here. So this, uh, I've just done the video joiner tutorial, so I've left the little movie that we made uh, on screen here. Now in order for all this to work, you have to have made a video. Okay, MovieZoo has to know that you've got a video already made and burnt and saved. Two other things you need to do, or one other thing, you need to make sure that you're logged in to our uh, website. Right now I am logged in, that's why this option says logged out. If you're logged out, then you have to make sure that you're logged in, which you can do with this button, or you can go to um, our website and log in. So the process of uploading it. Let's go upload to YouTube. Now, a little box has appeared, appeared off screen right there. Um, I'm going to type this out. I'm not going to let you see my uh, YouTube login details. I'm going to type them in and press the login button. Okay, the next thing that comes up is, uh, is all the questions that YouTube needs to know before you upload your video. So, category. Uh, probably entertainment I would say. The movie title is going to be called um, Green. The movie description is going to be a whole lot of junk. Please ignore. Movie keywords. Now you can put in all sorts of things in here. Any sorts of tag, um, tags and things like that to be uh, found on search engines. And then it's here you hit the privacy button. So if you want your video to just be private to you, then you'd have to hit private. If you want it to be public, and it'll only appear on our website, MovieZoo.com, if it is marked as public. Some legal stuff, terms of service, blah blah blah, um, a link to take you to the YouTube website if you want to look at their help or any of their tips and tricks. But for now, we just hit upload. You get a little progress bar. and you wait a second your file has been uploaded successfully okay let's head over and see what we've got the movies web webpage now remember what I said about it taking time it won't have appeared here and in fact it won't appear here for some time yet let me just zoom in a little when it does appear here we have to go to movies and latest and it would appear right here okay but anyway let's head over to um, my YouTube account and go down to videos and lo and behold the first one right here is green so it's worked 
However, sometimes what happens is in this field right here, it will say that um, movies are still uh, YouTube is still processing it, and YouTube is still decoding your video, working out what format it's in, tweaking it, you know, blah blah blah. Um, you can see that our descriptions appeared here. If we look into the the file a little bit more closely, you'd see that it'd be filled with the tags that we said that we set as well. Let's go and see what green looks like. Good. So step one, it's we've got it from MovieZoo up to YouTube. Now it's just a waiting game. YouTube will eventually release that video for broadcast. When it does so, it'll appear in our radar, and some people here will work out whether it's of decent quality and content, it's not going to offend anyone um, or get anyone sued and then if it passes those tests it'll appear on our front page under the latest section right here.